The overall goals of this experiment are to induce human FOXP3 positive regulatory T cells from naive CD4 T cells in vitro and to analyze their phenotype. This method can help to answer key questions in the T cell immunology field, such as how does regulatory T cell differentiation occur on the molecular level. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows the reproducible generation and phenotyping of human FOXP3 positive regulatory T cells. Although this method can provide insights into regulatory T cell differentiation, it can also be modified to study other CD4 T cell subsets and other immune cells of interest. The visual demonstration of this method is crucial because the PBMC and magnetic bead isolation steps are easy to understand when shown rather than described. To isolate peripheral blood T cells, begin by adding 15 milliliters of room temperature density gradient medium into five 50 milliliter tubes per Buffy coat, and bring the final Buffy coat volume up to 180 milliliters with room temperature PBS. Next, tilt a tube of density gradient medium to the side, and slowly layer approximately 35 milliliters of diluted blood onto the density gradient medium without mixing the solutions. Separate the cells by centrifugation. Then, transfer the white PBMC layers between the density gradient and the plasma phases from each tube into new 50 milliliter conical tubes. Wash the PBMC with 200 milliliters of fresh PBS. And resuspend the